Hi guys, welcome to Winky's Angel again. So yes, I'm back with the motivational video for you guys. I know I had skipped last month and I didn't do a motivational video for you all, but I'm back in action for you guys. Uh, so today's topic is what controls our mood. You know, uh, this is really everybody's problem. I've heard so many people saying, you know what, I have bad mood today. Or somebody saying, you know what, I have absolutely good mood today. So what controls our mood? I don't understand how these mood swings basically happen. Why somebody has a good mood, why somebody has a bad mood. So today I'll be explaining you the whole process as to how do you control your mood. What happens nowadays is, you know, our mood is sort of con controls us rather what is what should be done is you know we should control our mood but exactly opposite thing happens our mood controls us say for example if i'm having a good mood today i'll be very good at my work if somebody you know makes a big mistake at my work and i'll be like okay chuck it you know what i'm in a good mood today and i don't wish to argue whatever it is make sure you don't do it next time same situation, I'm in a bad mood and somebody does a very silly mistake. I'll be like, how dare you did that? You, I don't expect you to do such silly mistakes, you know? The behavior changes altogether. And the main reason is what changes our mood. Every little thing, you know, for example, uh, somebody says, uh, I, I didn't get what I wanted, so I'm very upset. Uh, somebody uh, says, you know what, that person uh, in the parking was honking so badly for no reason. That sort of upset my mood. Uh, you know what, I had a fight with somebody in the train today. So I'm pissed off. Like these little things or you know, somebody in the family is disturbed. So I'm in a bad mood. Basically, there are 500 reasons even more than that to upset your mood. What are these reasons? These reasons are just the situations which aren't favoring you. So any situation that doesn't favor you, it upsets your mood. If a situation favors you, it makes your mood. So somewhere, you know, you have to understand what happens in all these situations is the second person who, you know, sort of affects your mood. Second person may be a loved one of yours, maybe a random person, but it is all together of somebody else's thing impacting your head, impacting your mood. This shouldn't really happen. Uh, you know, like I just gave an example about, you know, if I have a good mood, how do I behave? If I have a bad mood, how do I behave? What we should do, you know, is we should make ourselves understand that whatever situation is, I won't let that affect my mood today. Morning, when you get up, make sure that, you know, today my mood is going to be absolutely amazing and nothing I would let affect my mood. Any reason, maybe, you know, anything. Once you start telling yourself that and you start believing in yourself saying that I have a good mood, everything would work bang on for you. It's just that, you know, you are impacted or you are upsetting your mood because of other person. Whereas that other person isn't even bothered, doesn't even know that that person has sort of spoiled your mood. So it's just in your head. You are just thinking, thinking, thinking about it, but the other person isn't even aware about it. Don't you think you're wasting your energy or your whole day because of somebody who isn't even knowing what the thing is and how did it affect your mood? So somewhere, you know, you have to realize that these things should not control your mood. I heard somebody the other day saying that, you know what? I missed my favorite show, Big Boss Today. That's the reason I have a I have a bad mood. I mean, really, just because you didn't see your favorite show on TV, that sort of pissed you off? No, these little things, these situations, it is a situation. Yes, situation wasn't in your favor. That's the reason you're upset. So just don't let these things impact you and make your mood bad and make it move accordingly. So make sure, you know, these, so make sure these little things don't impact you. Uh, so that is what I was just trying to make you all understand that don't let 
you know your mood rule you rather just rule your mood everybody has bad days so do you have but it's just that how you deal on those bad days uh so yes this was about it uh anything that is sort of disturbing you or that of that is sort of troubling you and you want me to just share my views like i've mentioned 100 times in my video i am no expert but i just you know sort of uh, love to explain how i deal with my situations if things come uh, in my thing how do i tackle with them even i am you know sort of uh, upset with certain things and how do i deal with my situations this was all for today so yes uh, stay tuned stay connected for my upcoming videos and if yes you have liked this video do not forget to give a thumbs up subscribe comment and yes this was all thank you guys bye